that could get me in a little bit of trouble. Maybe I shouldn't. Uh, the hell with it, I'm saying it. Um, this game uh, has gotten the texture of African-American hair so right. Uh, it's the only game I've ever seen to get it right. Um, and all of the looks, uh, the hairstyles, it's perfect. That's all I'll say. Seven and a good day to you as well. Got my hairstyles on. Yeah, all right, let's see. Um, what would this hairstyle they get? Um, we're gonna give him a scar. you guys feels like you guys are seeing I'm seeing it on my other screen here look yeah the color feels off dim almost or overly bright or why that is it's too bright the brightness is like up You look beautiful. Um, where were we? Um, that seemed like weird color, right? So weird. White hair for the man with the magic. It's kind of my hair color. Hopper. Uh, I like it. I like it. Good with it. One thing that's bothering me here, guys, is the the coloration from that I'm seeing here. It's not my source. Is this sourcing 1080p? <sighs> Can't help but wonder. Something to do with properties. Oh, yo, <laughs> hey, fixed. Hey, guys, I figured it out. <laughs> wow. Uh, I don't know how long that's been foobar, but uh, this 
is the actual coloration of this friggin' game. Wow, it looks so much better. All right. Uh, why don't we go with like a... Oh. Go with that. That's okay, right? Scar. Ooh. Um, I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. That was quite something. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. <laughs> it was wonderful. I believe I'm... I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. Well, I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Wizard's Dormitory, and... We'll name him... Um... Yeah, yeah. We'll go with... Ender... Draco. No. Yeah, we'll go with Drake. Why not? Stupid, I know, but, you know, let's do it. So start your journey. Here we go. Just a heads up, this is going to go zero to 60 quick. Ah, it appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well, I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me. Oh, <laughs> Eleazar! George! Glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theatergoers in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eleazar. Hmm? Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea! As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. Ages since I've been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. your traveling companion a new student new yes sir i'm starting school as a fifth year how extraordinary it is indeed none of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to hogwarts so late nor have i of course as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now the headmaster asked if i could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. 
Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> <coughs> Have you seen this? I have. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died. Wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I... ...received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl. But with no correspondence, I can only assume... That she had to get rid of it quickly. To keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Merlin's beard. How did you... Wait! We do... Dragon. See how he pulled it without a wand? Love it. Are you alright? You're hurt. Perhaps a bit. Take this. It's Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. What happened? Poor George. I can't believe he... What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage mid-air? A typical dragon would never... Professor? <sighs> Sir, <coughs> where are we? I'm not sure. <coughs> Excuse but me. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. <clears throat> I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Or why. take us farther from london than the carriage traveled we're somewhere in the scottish highlands sir those ruins do you the think the port key was meant to lead us there i do this has not been the day either of us expected but miriam sent that port key to george for a reason and i believe that she and now george died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to 
the talent it is you're sure you're all a right, gorgeous and game wouldn't mind indulging me I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely. It so. plays Good. really, really. Let's see if we can it find It plays path, really well. However also. faded it may be. Um, you feel Mind your like a wizard, if that makes sense. The the spell Where do you suppose your casting is really intuitive. A good question. Um, controls Miriam are well. Spent years searching for evidence of a long forgotten form of ancient magic. No, uh -uh. Ancient magic? Yes. That reminds me, though. Um, I put all of my stuff on high. That. Um, I'm not on ultra because, Powerful yes, I did have some of those jitters. Few. Seems um, to have been lost to time. But I, I removed it from Ultra. Hogwarts Castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know Postage. where she came into but possession I'm of the book. Here. Oh, I Hydra. am certain it was to do with that search. Mm. Mm. Ah, there's the path down below. This way. But, sir, why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. Excellent! Yes, I know. That was a bit rougher than I'd expected. Your wand works improving with every cast. Thank you, sir. Crazy now, stuff. it's just ahead. Holy the end. It is beautiful. Steady yourself. Reparo. Is Link. I don't like huts. Why would someone have built this here? I suspect they valued their privacy. That port key led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. How about a big giant mural on the wall? <laughs> Professor, it's a mural of some kind. Why, that's mm. true. 
for telling that is exactly what I'm doing. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> the potters. Get it. Get it. I get it. Professor. <laughs> this may have been his home. <laughs> Enchanted crystallized stone again, but what could it be blocking? Oh, the professor. What's this, Professor Fig? I love this. How are oh, Professor? Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? <clears throat> I didn't see anything. There's that glow again, like the glow on the port key container. <clears throat> what in Merlin's name? Godric's heart. Where are we? I don't believe it. Hello? Uh, not always, Ritalin. Sometimes they're just not so good. Just a moment. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Vault number 12, I presume. <clears throat> Precisely. The key? Hmm? The wife's porky. Oh, yes, of course. This way, then. Stay close. <whistles> After you. inside the cart if you don't wish to um <laughs> are you asking about in this point in the game or before at this point in the game no the character has not been um uh, sorted how many volts are there you'll get to see Hundreds. that actually in a few minutes in fact, too you'll see quite a few on our way to vault number 12 as we speak we're just beneath the main lobby the vault is now at the newest are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. You'll want to take a breath. A what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. Triple helix. 
16 months? My goodness. Hello, still Mary. <laughs> 16 inches of man mule. <laughs> Professor. Drake, how are you? Trip, how are you, brother? Like the glow you saw on the porky container. No, darker. I saw that same glow on the dragon's collar. Yeah, what was that? We were just wondering about that goblin back there. He watches over the oldest section of the Oh, is that what the they bank. call you? Rare anyone goes there anymore. Interesting. <laughs> Here we are. When was the last time this fort was accessed? A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12 until today. <clears throat> yeah, you should for sure, Trip. Vault 12, thank you for your help. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait! Best of luck. <sighs> Professor? That was certainly unexpected. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm, Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Revelio. Revelio. There, I saw something. Move a bit closer and try again. A door. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. <laughs> I don't suppose you see a way to... I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see yes, reveals the way but I can't forward, get to it. Then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. Lead the way. Lumos. I probably no I just didn't know about vault. it. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. Revelio. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. <sighs> there will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. see something up ahead what is it that glow again but on the floor <laughs> Lumos what happened when I moved towards the glow it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about are you all right Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue? What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Revelio, 
I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's like positions don't match. Wait. When you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. It's cute. Lumos. Well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Oh, oh you're talking to him. That makes sense. Oh, excuse me. Oh, no. oh God. Protego. Accio! Defendo! Let me go! Depose! Yeah, alright, come on. Let me go! Stupid! Exit! Oops! Can't bring it out! Seriously? Hey man, back off! Stay close, Lumos. Oh, yeah, that's right, Professor, Professor Fig. Professor, where oh, are come you? Oh, Kavotha, I've been doing okay, this buddy. This isn't good. Where am I supposed to go? Definitely dealing What's with happened? a lot of shipping. The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Um, I've been doing okay. I've been uh, in and out. Uh, just uh, uh, dealing with life. That's where they're leading me. That glow again. That. Uh, uh. Revelio. I suppose I'm on my own this time. It seems I have no choice. I'm going to have to fight my way out of here. Yeah, I already know. Oh, yeah, I've been working uh, for quite a while now. Seriously? Um, no, that's not quite the reason. I'm so I'm not in um, IT at the moment. I would love to be Lumos, uh, but I'm not. Um, but I am doing back to warehouse management essentially. Um, I like my job pretty decently. Um, I've just been stressing about other things, so and, and I've backed off a little bit, especially with. Um, Star Citizen in a state that I'm just not 100% interested in playing just yet. I'll get there. I will be. Um, but I'm just, at the moment, not real interested. So, yeah. Nevada Kedavara. Lumos. Okay. 
um, waiting for it to go live. Um, I, or playable, either or, honestly. I'm not really worried about when it goes live, but it hasn't been playable for me. Grim's been enjoying are. the hell out of it, and I'm super How happy for him, but I'm just not enjoying the PT with him. What is this place? I don't know, but I found this floating above that basin. That is no mere basin. Uh, sorry, guys. That is a pensive for viewing memories. I wonder. Follow my lead. I missed seeing you guys too. It's good to be back and good to see you guys back. I did create the character with the scar. There's multiple different scars. You got like three over the eyes. You got a lot of different ones, but I gave him that scar. It's, I think on this side. No, it's on this side of the face to the eye. All is in place. The porky is well hidden, perhaps too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic. No, this one does not. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the ritual wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge. Oh, we're back, and guys. We're back. That Last them. week was station tomorrow night. We do we fleet builders. We got some stuff coming. You're gonna love it. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces. Of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. <laughs> It'll Miriam, be on YouTube the George next day. <laughs> not gonna make you. That has been I'll, I'll put it up on YouTube. Uh, I'll edit it and get it up on and YouTube you, within the week. Are the key to understanding why. We were. <sighs> looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in here. I was right. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. <laughs> I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's Vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let <laughs> bygones be bygones. <clears throat> uh, sir, they have the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that... The instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have them. I have no patience for traitors. Now, where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well... Perhaps your young friend here will be more
You're going to love it, Kavatsa. You really are. Do you need me to shut this off? I don't want to spoil anything for you. I, I just enjoy it so much. I can actually skip ahead where you're not seeing a bunch. If you need to, I've got another character. Fine, sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. Okay. It seems okay. those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Have fun, Mary. Steal. Yes, we are about to get sorted. Just in time for the sorting ceremony. I'm so <clears throat> Ritalin. This can work one of two ways. Way number one, um, you can go to the website. Oh, we haven't missed the do sorting this questionnaire, ceremony. and it picks a house for you I'm based no on your answers to the questions. That mine. Appropriate. Put me now. I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the ministry. Um, they mine put me into Gryffindor. I'm thinking about selecting a different for the moment. Star. I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me, of course, sir. We already know what it is. Ready for the sorting, sir? It's a, it's a Scorpius, it's a EMP Scorpius. That person, him, Simon Pegg. <laughs> Phineas Nigellus Black. Prepare yourself to meet I agree, it does suck. The headmaster. Fig, nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has... Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. Professor Weasley, <laughs> we've one more to be sorted. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations.
Hmm. I'm looking forward to meeting my professors and learning all I can at Hogwarts. Indeed. Hogwarts has much to offer a dedicated student. And what you learn in class will prepare you for challenges outside the classroom as well. Mm. Oh, but you're brave at heart. Exceptionally daring. Undaunted by the unknown. Willing to forge ahead alone when you must. Perhaps you belong in Gryffindor. So. I can go with Gryffindor. But my other characters are Gryffindor. think I think I'd like to see the Slytherin but maybe hey Driz what uh, what house are you going to go with when you play your game you'd say you're going to go with uh huh okay well that doesn't help Well, I, I'm, I'm, I'm. Yeah, I'll just do two forgotten houses. I'll do Ravenclaw. And you've a ready mind, quick to learn. And yeah, all right. Loyalty yeah, let's to do a, a poll. friend delayed your arrival here this evening. All right. to see the common room yeah it doesn't um in the grand scheme of things the house doesn't really matter right it just places you in the house it's a different common room so it's kind of a different feel when you're playing but everything kind of goes for the one so thing is the robes they're pretty standard uh, I do like that it changes oh, the colors and one more thing due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled <laughs> enough it's not as though I've banned flying altogether but don't tempt me you are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. So, I don't know, uh, Ritalin. I connected my I'm Professor Weasley. Um, would you be so kind to, to show our new student to their common room? My Harry Potter fan account. 
And I saying, because I did I that, it automatically selects that nice you as well, all that information from is, that account, my distinct honor to which is actually kind of cool, right? right this way. Um, yeah, it knew I was in Gryffindor. It knows my wand, which is a uh, uh, silver limewood, thirteen inch, uh, with a phoenix heart. Uh, or Phoenix sure Core. Um, it knows what my yeah, Patronus is going to be. Um, it's it's a pretty this cool little the like they they thought about some stuff on this. Do, but I hesitate to do it myself as one errant knock leads to being doused in vinegar. Most unpleasant. You must tap the barrel two from the bottom, yeah. middle of the second row, in the rhythm of Helga Hufflepuff. Do it, dude. <laughs> well done. Now go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Guys, there's so much cool shit that you're gonna get to see here. Uh, well, I will. Oh, this common room is cozy. Looks like everyone's gone. These are actually cozier common rooms. Like the the bedrooms themselves are cozier than the Gryffindor. Interesting. Have some tea. A cuppa. Let's get out of here. Yeah, cozy. Boys, hey girls. Oh, uh, this feels like a hobbit hole, doesn't it? Go on an adventure! Uh, it feels like, yeah, Slytherin would probably be dank and wet. Okay, so. I suppose some introductions are in order. Hello, Lenora Evely. <clears throat> She's awfully regal, isn't she? Is that your owl? I don't know who she is. Likely one of the Hufflepuffs around here. Owls choose their own company anyway. It Wait, does feel like a hobbit hole, doesn't it, Ritalin? Quite the dramatic entrance you made. Can't imagine wanting to call attention to yourself. Especially since everyone will be watching to see how much you already know. I am a bit concerned. I have a lot of catching up to do. Indeed. Four wife. years of school. So me work and my wife are both Gryffindors. Far behind. I'd feel uh, so my buddy's wife was a, uh, a Slytherin. Of course. He was a uh, Ravenclaw. As a hard-working Hufflepuff, you'll prove yourself in no time. I'm hard-working too, as you might suspect. But sometimes I think I should have been a Ravenclaw. I've rather a searing wit. <laughs> At least people have always told me so. I'm Lenora, by the way. Lenore Everly. Well, mustn't keep you. You've such a lot to do. It was nice meeting you, Lenora. Of course. Adieu. So, the one thing that... I won't say it always bothered me, but it did kind of bother me. That bothered me about the Harry Potter movies was there wasn't a lot of interaction with the other houses. It was all Gryffindor. All three of the main characters were Gryffindor. Even though one of those main characters should have definitely been a Ravenclaw and one of them should have been a Hufflepuff. You don't need to be frightened, um, in this game, it's completely different. Interact with everybody. And it's not, they don't make Slytherin out to be all assholes. Hope they can catch him. Big castle for a student oh, to Mr. get lost in, let alone a cat. <laughs> I'm sure you'll find your way, all right? I mean, it can be a bit overwhelming at first. I still get lost sometimes. <laughs> Welcome to Hufflepuff, by the way. Really glad to have you in our house. I'm Arthur. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Was that your cat? No, one of the first years, I think. Don't have any pets of my own, unfortunately. My mother doesn't think too highly of them, especially magical ones. I'm sorry to hear that. 
I think magical beasts are rather incredible. Best thing about coming yes, to Hogwarts. They are different Nifflers, people, but I have met circles. these people they were uh, around the castle before. and helped them oh, in quests and things like that. Once. So these people are actually Rumble's throughout glorious. the game. <laughs> You're just meeting anyway, new people. I better go make sure the first year's Slytherin, <laughs> one of the people that I like day. in the in the castle, one of the guys that is like a good friend uh, to my character. Um, Have you ever had is a, a Slytherin? No. Uh, and that's my it's it's really muggle. neat to and kind of that my dad get to know these guys a little bit, up her kind of learn right them. Back to the shop. <laughs> nice meeting you, Arthur. And good luck finding that cat. Thank you. Try not to get lost in the castle yourself. I feel like there's something with these globes. Because Revelio. these globes show up as blue when you reveal them. Let's see. In other places. This one. Adelaide Oats. Have I met you, Adelaide? Oh, Uncle, this doesn't sound like you. Something's wrong. No. Oh, hello there. You're the new Hufflepuff, yes? I'm Adelaide. Pleasure to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. Is everything all right? Oh, yes. I'm just a bit distracted. Letter from my uncle. So tell me, I've been hearing all sorts of rumors. Were you really nearly gobbled up by a dragon? That one is true. Not the typical start to a new school. That's dreadful. Well, I'm glad you made it here alive. Well, anyway, I imagine you have lots to do. I hope you have a wonderful first day. Are you sure everything is all right with your uncle? Oh, yes. He travels for work, always busy. I'm sure he just wrote it in a rush. Um, nothing to worry about. Thank you, Adelaide. Be seeing you. Of course. And good luck. Is the new Hufflepuff out of bed yet? Professor Weasley's waiting for them outside the common room. I used to enjoy flying. Okay. <laughs> I liked the way this common room opens. Good it's morning. very different than Gryffindor, <laughs> where it's I've just a swinging a painting. Time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? <laughs> Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. Ordinary wizarding level exams. After much discussion- I hope I don't have to take those. I'm oh, gonna fail. At the ministry, We've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Here you I'll are. Right back, guys. She's going to explain this for a second. I think. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. Ah, here we go. Uh, no ma'am. Revelio. Aw. Oh. Come on, I just saw it. It's not showing up. This way. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding lore. <laughs> I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. Do keep up. I'll have an apple. Simply cast Revelio on it 
And we'll see what the guide says. Revelio. Uh, what am I cap? open for more opportunities like that inside and outside of the castle uh, not quite but it is a very good way to gain it <clears throat> no i mean there are battles outside of the school um so ah, I don't good know, time sure. perfect opportunity to show you how to use blue uh, flames blue to get powder your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. what's happening yeah i am hufflepuffin and here we are quite the time saver these stairs lead directly to central hall Want you Let's see you can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from central hall look at that always something happening here fucking cool is this part of the hive our King's Cross Station, so to speak. Hi, Dragon. Revelio. Where's that? It's a page there, but I don't have Akio. Don't have Akio. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. What will I learn in Charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes, all terribly useful. I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. He's a clever <laughs> and entertaining wizard and a talented teacher. Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. A mastery of Defense Against the Dark Arts is required for those who aspire to become Auras. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecate in charge of our students' education in that regard. You mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain and is home to an array of shops and pubs. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. So, unlike... Uh, the Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb Potter's. on your first day, oh. and you have much um. to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create to additional to assignments for you travel. outside of class. Um, You'll be up to speed in no outside. time. Judging by your adept well, use of Revelio earlier, not okay. I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. I'm sorry, Professor, but I'm afraid that's all there is to it. Hmm. Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. Speak of the devil? Professor Fig! Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, oh, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. 
they've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. In and invaluable. invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival? I did my best, but I'm fairly certain she suspects that we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. Leviosa. Okay, so <clears throat> I like that it tells you how many chests there are, how many chests and pages and statues are here. Interesting. Very interesting. Uh, charms first. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly <sighs> helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, Focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. All right, let's head. Learn a couple of spells. And let's go get uh, our own wand, shall we? The peeps? Revelio. That ding that you hear is a page. No, oh, there's one. Where it's at. Down here. Down here. Revelio. There. Where, where's that? I'm gonna find you. Yes. Too afraid to fight you, scurvy cur. Ha! I dare say you've heard of my proficiency with a blade. 
So... Let's go. Let's go the way we're supposed to. Sir Cardigan! Revelio. Oh, Kitty. Oh. Keeps on here in the gym, bro. Pull it out, bro. Revelio. Professor Brendan tends to go on a bit. We sometimes have to remind him to finish the lesson. Some of us don't necessarily want him to get back to the lesson. I got called on to read out loud in History of Magic the other day. Hello, Ginger. New logo indeed. What do you think? Hope you like it. Real. Did an amazing job. I think it's, uh, he reveals his tonight. Revelio. No, it wasn't. <gasps> oh, what fun! I won't say my goodbyes. I shall cheer for the boy who says Okay, he's so. I'm not telling lies, Peeves. It was Albert Boot. <sighs> no, it wasn't. It was I am going to solve oh, this without. Oh, I'm going to solve this without speaking so that uh, I don't give away the secret. I already know the secret, so. <laughs> And he says it's a flat. Thieves, enough. You'll get us all detention. Oh, and you're both wrong anyway. It was Hephaestus Gore. It wasn't Boots and it wasn't Flack, but you're all in trouble with Professor Black. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Revelio. Oh. Is that a Thestral? It is. We're all Thestrals. Room full of Thestrals. Um, so. Equip some gear. Cool thing is, you can make stuff look however you want. Cool. Be a dark wizard. Set our appearances. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I I figured the door out. Um, it was uh, difficult. <clears throat> I was so close to the correct answer, uh, but I was I was only ever so slightly off so it kind of but figured it out okay. let's see 
begin the quest. Oh, cool. Yeah, I know this one. It is a math. Here. Uh, yes. Behind you. There is an open seat here. Thank you. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. I mean, I'll reveal it if you want, Ginger. <clears throat> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of charms. Now, this will be a crucial year in your okay. education on the art of charm work. But I am confident. Um, I'll tell you. With a passion and rigor requisite of There's an area that you will find right? now, a everyone, code that will tell you the answer. But before we begin, I luckily found that code. The difference between um, the incantations of the color change and growth charms. I had tried a lot of anyone? doors. Anyone? Hmm? Uh, 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 I am afraid it is too late to study now. Mmm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, mm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Mm? Sorry. Mm. Well, it seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. Akio! Yay! Akio! That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. Hey, that's the guy right there. After me. After me. I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> so, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm? That to Slytherin the that's right I... by him. That's the guy that's like. <laughs> Why don't we have our newest students start us off? Hmm? Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Can I do it as well as I did the first time? Very simply, cast Akio on one of the spheres. Excellent control there. Now, uh, think of this like gobstones, if you will. But instead of throwing the marbles out, that's it! Oh. I'm not sure. Very good. Cool. One thirty. Very good. Points to Hufflepuff. But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. <laughs> You'll be the blues just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. What's this? That is how it's done. 
It should have been a Slytherin. Here's why. Akio. Fucked up. I fucked up. Excellent. I gave her 50 Good points. Let us see this. Let's dump. Let's trying to knock her off. Try it again. This time I'm actually going to get it done. Yes! Huh? Oh, fuck myself too. Here we go. Now I gotta hit this one and, and take her out. Can I do it? Akio. Oh, that was an execution. Let us make this a bit more interesting, shall we? Sure. So when I played this last time, I was a Gryffindor. <laughs> so <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. Um, I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. It didn't matter who won. Let's go to Gryffindor. Slow, 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 you son of a bitch. Let us see this. I suck this time. Yes. I did that the last time too, funny enough. Um uh -oh. Did it again. Not to worry. Let's go to Gryffindor this time, folks. Go. Well, she's done because I fucking suck. Ugh. That's a shame. Points to Gryffindor. Very good, both of you. Well done. Oh, no points to Gryffindor this time. Excuse me. Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. Well done back there. You took the loss in stride. Didn't want to go too easy on you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. It took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. That's good to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. Is Wagadu much bigger than Hogwarts? <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the largest wizarding school in the world. So yes, bigger than Hogwarts. But it never seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me. It always felt like home. So bright in my face, I just don't want it in my face anymore. Sorry. Is Wagadu a castle like Hogwarts? It addresses <laughs> mountains of the moon. It is not so much a castle as a beautiful edifice. The address is the mountains. Of the I remember the first time I saw it, the mist was so thick I could hardly make out anything at all. And then it just materialized. Uh, what do you mean, Ginger? Me. 
this enormous school that seemed to be floating in midair. This may seem an odd question, but is magic the same there as it is here? Mm, mostly, yes. But I did have to learn how to use a wand when I arrived here. Hardly anyone at Wagadu uses one. You can cast spells without a wand. Oh, yes. I find wandless magic to be much more instinctive. Not to mention quite convenient if one is without their wand. I must admit, however, that I am growing quite fond of using a wand. It seems very dramatic. It's nice to learn about another wizarding school. Thank you for asking. I do miss Wagadu, but I am glad to be here at Hogwarts. What do you mean licenses? Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. But Are you saying like waiting. Until next licenses time. for our, like for us to sell merch? Of course, you can use Akio. A word hands, if you would. If you're so inclined. You wanted to speak with me, Professor? I did. I trust your um, first <sighs> lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly I don't know. the lesson I was expecting, sir. What's Charlie I don't know how easy that's going to be. I don't know is what all will go into witch. it. Take it in stride. Um, one often gains the most from the what? battles one has I, lost. I gotta ask, what's course, bringing Professor. this question up? It was a challenging up. match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor. Mm. I sense that she is JRDF is working directly with CIG. <clears throat> Um, now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you that's more of a partnership than of the a licensing thing. curriculum. Uh, and they have to follow some soon, very, very, very strict that I am rules. Preparing for you. CIG has to sign off on everything. And I do mean everything. There. Even the box You're art. You're the new student, aren't you? Hello. You wanted to speak to me? Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. Hope your first day's going well. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. <laughs> I've been fortunate. Beginner's luck. <laughs> My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, well, he tends Ginger, to be overconfident in here's him. the beauty of that. Well, better see to my charms homework. I'm afraid I can't count on beginner's luck to impress ah, Professor Ronan. And there's the rub. So here's the beauty. Um, you can make those magnets for yourself. You can't sell them. Um, Akio! Yeah. I don't know. So, would I like them to, to sell it? It would probably be nice, right? Um, it does worry me, though, uh, because, man, uh, if they do, right, they can crack down on the stuff that people are doing that they shouldn't be. Uh, Prime example would be uh, that Super Bowl commercial. Did you fall and break your back there? Um, but, and it would allow them to crack down on people who like go through display and try to sell their stuff on display. Um, but, it would also mean that we all probably have to pay uh, a not one-time fee to to sell those items. Um, and I'm not sure how I feel about that. Revelio. Defense against the dark arts. I'm late starting. <laughs> Got. Uh, so. Professor Hecket. Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces in your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. 
It was a token from the great poacher raid well. of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. <sighs> now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest... That's just it. I don't think that it's a... ...and lived to boast about it. ...one-time license much. fee. I think it would be a... a to the wise, re-up on that license, right? Today and there would be some very, yet. very the serious restrictions. For example, Levioso, say Levioso. A Fleet Viewer Levioso. required a license. A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Me, me. Care to defend Let's yourself, Master Pruitt? No? Okay. One thing yeah. I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now, Let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Bloop, bloop, blap, blap, Levioso! Levioso. So, thank you for shouting her out, bingo. Now. Let's try something a little larger. I gave you that sword, Ginger. <laughs> Let us begin with a basic cast. So let me pause. Okay, maybe not. Deflected your cast. I did, this and one, also what? Cast Leviosos first, then the basic cast. Remember, a surprise. Good. Well done. Well Leviosa. done. Very good. But the best way to practice <sighs> is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelist, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, I want I got worried when when you listening to this that cost and Protego. You may begin. Oh no no, we'll get there. We'll get there. I just want to finish this. Good I know. Wait, what? How's the view? Levios! Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. <laughs> He's a really nice guy. <laughs> I put you on the spot. And you rose to the challenge. Points oh, to Hufflepuff. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards... Or right, I'm almost, I'm like almost to a goblins, point where I can... Dive into this conversation. Of and in entirely. fact, I'm going to Understood, use Professor. a. So, I'd advise you to keep um, practicing whenever you can. A, a visual. Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. Okay, oh. I'm gonna pause. <sighs> Why? Why is this? Why? Why is this this way? What? <laughs> This is dumb. Why? <laughs> is it because I, it's a too much? Yeah, it's too much. That figures. Oh, whatever. You know what? <sighs> it's fine. Life's what it is right now. Okay, so let me open up my standby. All right. 
So, leave viewer. Okay. Let's say <clears throat> Star Jump decided, okay, our, our Star Citizen, CIG, decided we're going to sell uh, the ability to make money off of our stuff licenses. Nope. Here is where things get funky. And this is JRDF, okay? Uh, if you look at their ships that they currently have the ability to sell. Uh, in fact, I have... Citizen. Now. Out. 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 All available. All available. Available. That one's going to be available. Okay. So. Let's see. Okay, these are the best examples right now. Okay, you're not monopolizing the stream. I'm very much, enjoy I'm going to enjoy this conversation uh, because you're bringing up something that I would like to happen, but I know it's best not to happen. So these ships alone, the merchant man's not out and is subject to change. If we had a license, we would not be allowed, and CIG would be well within their rights to say you're not allowed to have that. CIG would basically get control of any merch sold. Yeah, we have a license, but they would the the stipulation for having that license would be we have to approve it. And they will never approve anything that is like this, not out. This, not out. These, not out. Or like this, custom. Yeah, it looks very, very similar, but it's a Yacht Club. Yacht Club there. Excuse me, I'm sorry. So, while I'm all for... We're not Apollo. Apollo. That, huh? Anyway, while I'm all for having um, a license and, and requiring a license, um, they would have to approve everything we did and it would severely restrict what we do. True. Um, and it, so I, I'm I'm for it and I'm against it. It'd be nice because uh, Displate, let's see. Let's see. Let's see here. Well, here's here's a prime example. Wonder if this guy is Let's do spaceship. Sixty-four. Actually, let's see. Let's see.
Okay, four, four. Oh, <laughs> look at that. Somebody, this is, uh, <laughs> you probably saw whose that was. That's a display that uh, I'm surprised got shut down. I'm a little bit surprised by that. Um, yeah, let me show you this one. So this guy, let's see if he still has it or if he was forced to remove it, which is likely. Looks like he might have removed. I'll be. Yeah, he sure was. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. You'll notice, by the way, that all of his look the same here. Uh, it's because he just took a picture and put it through a uh, filter. Um, it's ridiculous. This guy used to have star jump assets. Um, on his stuff, and he was passing them off as his own art. Um, but... He also had a lot of like planets, CIG planets, and it was stuff that was taken in game. You could tell he had taken in game pictures, right? But he can't do that and sell it on display and and make money off of it. Um so yeah, this guy. I wonder if he sells it stuff. Um so it's stuff like that. Banu rescue poster? Really? Let me look it up, Banu. Look at that. This is fan this is from art that was that was this is oh my god. Wonder if he's got more. He sure does. Look at that. <laughs> And he's got that. So, yep. <clears throat> so stuff like this, they should I, they shouldn't be allowed to do that. But they're being, you know, they're able to do it because it flies under the radar. Now, you can put this on your own, and you know, do your own thing and, and buy it for yourself. That's a whole different thing. You're not making money off of it, but this guy is selling it to make money. He should, he should get in trouble for that. He really should. And that's what licensing, buying those licenses would stop. But at the same time, it would cause issues in other areas. We'll just leave it at that. Um, you would only be able to sell specific items uh, to specific, you know, ships. And you wouldn't be able to do everything else. So. It would be good and bad. There would be some goods. There would be some bads. Um, yeah. Yeah. The grip would be far tighter than, than anybody would want it. Um, I genuinely think. And it's, and I'm not saying that that's a bad thing, by the way. I want to be very, very uh, clear about that. No, don't abandon it. Still want to. Can you just, uh, finish off? Here you go. I'd hate to face Professor Hecate. Oh, I'm not much. You drilled Sebastian. He's strong competition. Well done. Nice work. I was worried that the Sebastian that. guy was going to be a jerk, by the quite way. something. Such Everyone nice was talking day. about it. It was I'm really interested in seeing where practice. his story goes. And it kind felt of more like I was dueling an expert. Sebastian Sallow, by the way, didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. 
I've jeweled enough. Consider yourself lucky I held back. Ah, uh, that's not what I wanted. Fair enough. You owe me an honest jewel when you aren't. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain I'm very happy to answer, and you did not divert. I divert. You asked a question. He does kind of look like Ender's little brother. Exclusive and unsanctioned. Psst, or big brother? Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most, are you talking about my bit, my little brother? You're going to need That's to rude. break the rules now. And rude. Then. Whether it's joining a secret jeweling <laughs> club or sneaking into the restricted section Ginger. of the library, you just have to be Ginger. clever enough not to get caught. Ginger. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll hey, that, that, in mind. that thing that Good. we talked about. Pleasure are you, you are you moving sure forward you with that? Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned. We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. He did have it if taken down, Kavotha. Very smartly had it taken down. Till next time. Um. Yeah, yeah, he was definitely very much in the wrong uh, for for that particular display. He was able to get away with it for a while, Revenue. but I think he he got very lucky in in being able to do that. If you know the right spells, it's dark wizards that'll fear you. Excellent. Not the other way around. Um, adventure, we? I'm not. Well, it should be. Um, until you're ready to move forward with it, it should be. But you'll get there. Um, <laughs> Kavotha, yes and no. I'm not overly surprised. Um, for a lot of reasons. <laughs> Let's go meet Professor Weasley. I'll do the crossed wands in a bit. Although I do like having some... Actually, let's do crossed wands now. I want to be able to duel with what I know. Let's do crossed wands. What? Hold it. See, that's the thing. The screen wallpapers are fine. It's it like wallpapers and so it's selling items that is not okay. Revelio. Okay. Oh, not again. Here I've come from the toilet bowl where she said I could swim. Did you practice a mole? As long as for only one time per week, I can plunge the boy's lavatory. Not for the meek. Please, Peas, you'll make me late. He tried to stop me, did rancorous carp, sought to trap me, confine me inside of a jar. But he failed us, did his containment charms, so I took my revenge to wreak havoc and harm. It was granted my privileges, be handsome indeed, or I'd fire up the cannon, and so she agreed. To draw up a contract with her, not with him. That if I behaved, I'd have one weekly swing. Well, oh, there's a. That's what. Yeah, that's why. And he's homeschooled. That's so why my kids are homeschooled too. Let's go over here. Revelio. Oh yeah, it's good you. Peeves <laughs> what? <laughs> Peeves, you are annoying me. No. <laughs> what is it? Are you okay? Akio. <sighs> Revelio. Oh God, she's falling. Eves, what have you done? <laughs> Akio. That one. Let's try. Oh, there it is. And now, see, I shouldn't be getting this. The game is messing up on me. Uh. Oh, we're going to save real quick. Okay. Settings. Save. Yeah. All right. I'm going to 
exit the game real quick. Confirmed. T posing to begin shortly. Give me five seconds, guys. I'll be right back. More than five seconds. So, Kavatha, are you saying are you saying that you blame Star Citizen for bugs in other games? Or <laughs> I'm just kidding. I know. Hogwarts Legacy. You know, I'd love this to be an MMO. I mean, you never know. <laughs> you never do know. Um, I would love to have a Hogwarts MMO. Just throwing that out there into the world. Just throwing it out. Let that fester out there and maybe somebody will pick it up and do something with it. Now, um, tomorrow we have a fleet builders think you guys are really gonna like it okay it's pirates versus how did he put it pilfered pillaged uh uh yeah 10 of 10 especially if it were based off of this right here like the the way it plays all of it if it were based off of this game so this is my character as you can see i, I pretty much built them the same didn't i Gee, let's see uh the hair's different, scars are different, but we'll continue. <sighs> Not quite. Uh, <laughs> um, where was I going? Let us see what there is to see. Glad you can make it. Lucan's just over there. Levioso. All right, let me see. Ooh. That's pretty cool. I actually hadn't noticed that before. Can I help you? Can. Actually, little boy. Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinate duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. I'm flattered to hear that. 
Sebastian's not a bad duelist either. Imagine it's quite something to see the two of you duel. How does cross wands work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. It's our way of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And um, up, no, should I? The Are there stuff that drops for this game? Critic? Of course. Dueling's an entertaining part. No, bingo. I agree. Besides, oh. in cross ones, you could duel oh, with a partner if you like. Enable drops. So first of all, I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next um, time, you'll need to bring a partner how do I do it? or duel alone. So, care to step into the ring? Hang tight, everyone. I'm going to enable drops. Hey, that was bad. I shouldn't have done that. I'm sorry. <laughs> Settings. Where do I go? Where do I go? What do I do? Your rewards. Drops. Enabled. How do I get the drop? I want the drop too. Are you sure? I think they're enabled. What do I do? How do I do it? You said definitely do fake accents. Okay. Get I'm the ready. Room. Spectacular. Let the fireworks begin! We'll make you regret signing up. Oh, your face makes me regret signing up. Yeah. Akio. Stupid one. Akio, there goes my way. You're better than that, Levioso. Akio. Act like a winner. Jesus. <laughs> I'm just devastated there. <laughs> nice work. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. Wow! How do how do the drops work? Could be the next school champion. So it can take up to five Tell minutes. Me. Oh, I wow, watch it. Now, it rewards. It's time to organize these duels, but check with me later. I may have something oh, lined up for yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, congratulations wow. on your first cross one victory. Oh, okay. Hope to see you back minutes, here again. Thirty minutes. Thirty minutes. Thirty minutes. Okay. Cool. And uh, okay. Well, I guess I'm going to get the drop. I don't really know. I'm watching myself, so. <sighs> I'm sure you make an account on the WB site. I already have one. Um, I already have it. That's actually how I got. So on the WB site, you can make an account and it, it like gives you your house, your wand, everything. It's pretty cool. Oh, mistakes were made. I didn't need we're to do that yet. Uh, yeah, it'll be all right. Let's use a flu system here and go where we need to go. Yep. Level four. Thanks to the happiness of the people, we were able to make it. Simple for everyone. Yeah, that's how you got into Hufflepuff. I chose Hufflepuff. I'm a Gryffindor. Um, and I really tried hard not to be. <laughs> you just answered the questions, man. I like that they make it not obvious. Like, you can answer a question, and it's not obviously connected to the... Um, 
house that you're going into right away. I like that. Felt more real. Didn't sound dumb. Revelio. Did feel more real. You mean that? Did you? No. Oh. I think I'm supposed to do something. What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, uh, I don't... excuse, Deke. What's Charlie Hoppin... Hop... Ah, Hopkinson? There you are. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Heck and <clears throat> Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me, isn't there? Have you and Professor Fig not discussed my training? He continues to be reticent about the details, mentioning only a few spells. Revelio oh, yeah, 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 I did, I did, I did. That's correct, Professor. Very much enjoyed I watching him be Gandalf. Regardless, you must continue to build yes. upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors old to help man you your progress meet. with some extra 3,000 years old, and he didn't even bend the knee when he learned. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, <laughs> Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, <laughs> regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spellcrafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. I'm going to customize my wand a little bit. Well, with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast <clears> with your I didn't own last time. I just went with the one they gave me because it was the one. But let's go. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Yeah, Bingo. I very much enjoyed watching him. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. I went with Natty last time. I'd like to go with Sebastian this time. I'd like to go with Sebastian. Glad to hear it. <laughs> More Sallow voices are good. Young wizard, and he don't, knows the don't, area. Don't do that. He'll don't keep you well that. clear yeah, of any that. of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Rose's assignment, Theo. your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner okay, you complete I mean, your work, the sooner you okay. can enjoy a butterbeer at the three broomsticks. What? Sure. Yeah, mine was, um... Oh, the one I had received was... Silver Limewood... Thirteen inches and a phoenix core. Yes. Very interesting. Oh, kitty cat. Got to pet it. Come here. I'm going to pet all the cats. Sorry, guys. You're going to see this a lot. My daughter. <laughs> My daughter heard me say I'm going to pet all the cats, and she got excited. See? Petting the cat. Kitty cat, that's the one. <laughs> In my opinion, is a load of rubbish. Oh yeah, there's there's tons all over the house. Ah, there you are, Mister Ronan. What can I do? You for have a new you? spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed, I do. I have an exceedingly Abby. useful one at that. The mending okay. charm, Repero. Fixes things right Repero. up. Makes a broken like object that. good as new in the blink of an eye. <laughs> 
It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have a your magic. for today. See them through and then report back to me. We will have you casting Ropero in no time. What would be cool for a mechanic, Bingo? If I had to use this voice every time I talk? I'll start on the task right away, Professor. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. What do you need me to do? Collectifying page near the broken statue. Where's the broken statue? Is this the broken statue? Man, if it is. Oh, that's the broken statue. This is the right repair. area. Hey, buddy. Got it. Got it. Let's go collect this one too. A flying page must be around here somewhere. Revelio, don't get too cookie simply because you had one victory over Sallow. He never backed down from the fight. Accio. Brilliant. Sallow will be my friend before the end of the year. <laughs> yeah, but then you're like, like, oh, statue, broken statue, Rippetto. Oh, that'll be seven galleons, please. I trust the preliminary tasks weren't. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us you guys remember V for Vendetta? Charm, try then, I'd love to be able to do that guy's remember voice to from be that. What's his name? In your enunciation oh, and movements. I want to it, see it, the guy that plays the now, wand at the ready. big bad. Yes, remember, your wand is a conduit of your magic. Oh, you've slipped an X in there. Sneaky, sneaky. Alliteration joke. That's probably not it. <laughs> Feels not right. No, not Hugo. Uh, the bad guy, not the good guy. Although I guess bad guy is. Very good. If you would like to practice it on your have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate. And Revelio. Bad. Not Agent, no, that's Hugo Weaving. Levioso. Hugo Weaving is Agent Smith, but he was not the big bad. He was the good guy. He was he was V. Oh hell, I've got to look it up now. <laughs> v for Vendetta. He sounded like that. But maybe he does it better, obviously. Uh, yeah, John Hurt. Oh my God, I can't believe I didn't know John Hurt. John Hurt. Uh, he he he. The he's the guy with the chest burster. This guy. <clears throat> okay, really, seriously. Uh, hello. There we go. John Hurt. Really great actor. Good guy. Oh. Guy. Sure. The main bad guy. Senator. Yes, it was Senator Padme. You got it. On the head there, Pete. You nailed that one, buddy. Where am I going? Sebastian at the entrance to Hogwarts. That's the way to this door. Revelio. Something? Yeah. Build yourself. What's that? I saw a page. Did you guys see that page? That is <gasps> Two 
in a row. Fucking amazing. Hey, okay. We're going to do this for this lady. Possibly be as difficult as it seems. Hello, it's really Nora. not, Lenora. What are you looking at? Everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. Samantha thinks I'm potty. <laughs> but it's this painting. I never noticed it before. If I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. There's something more to this. Look her face. <laughs> She, so I don't like her face, Ginger. I did discover like, that casting Lumos has an effect of some kind. But I'm not sure what to do next. Follow the fucking clues. If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. I've been racking my brains long enough. I hope you'll have better luck than I have. In fact, I'm going to have better luck meeting you in front of you. Lumos. Do come and find Lumos. me. Lumos. That's down the stairs. I should look around in case it's nearby. Come Let's get you to back Potter. To ha, I knew there was a connection. I should tell Lenora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. I want to play Quidditch. Is she really? Yeah, see. Lenora, I solved the mystery of that painting. You did? How? I found the location depicted in the painting, and then I cast Lumos to guide a moth back to the frame. All very logical, I suppose. A pity I was so close to solving it. You have a knack for solving riddles. Natty's good at that too. So is a meat, although he does tend to overexplain. Well, I'm glad someone figured it out. The moth. I... You should have seen it. You're an idiot. And you should definitely go fuck yourself. Probably wasn't very nice. But that was very mean, and I should less of that. Oh. Sebastian. Oh, I'm in the library! Whoa! Yay, library! This I'm being here without it being an accident or part of a quest. Rebellion. Hello? Give this note. Huh? I would like to go to the restricted section. Can you allow me to do that? Off on another adventure, Get it out from there. Hello? Revelio. Hello? You end up using Revelio a lot. Um, length, girth, it's really about just push, uh, leverage. Guys, yeah, there a ladies present? Okay. Can't believe you let, I let you drag me into this conversation. Accio. Very sorry. Oh, and Ginger's here. So it's like ladies and I'm Ginger. I'm kidding. You, Ginger, too. Friend. Ginger, you're just very foul-mouthed at times, so it's like, <sighs> kind of, you get where they're coming from. Huh? Not even a little bit. Gina's own joke. Hey! No, ma'am. No, ma'am. It's, <laughs> it's always my fault. Where? How do I get out of this room? in here. I'm never going to be able to leave. I'm trapped. Revelio. What 
What was that? For real, I am trapped, though. How do I get out of here? She is far from in this. I know, I walked, but that, I, I thought there was another one. There's no other way. Okay. Let's get out of here and go the right way. I've got a thing telling me to go back, so I'm an idiot. Hello, and welcome to Ender is an Idiot. I'll be your host for today, Ender. I don't know. Do I look like I study? I love these guys, by the way. They'll, they'll hum and then the one hits them. Like, dude, shut it. Revelio. You, yeah. <laughs> yes. Uh, get it correct. Oh, build one. Innocent angel. Revelio. The three drow, three drow spells. All right. You're not attacked. Maybe I can, but do I want to? Is really the question. Well, fancy me Rebellion. Look at this guy. Sebastian. Hello, Sebastian. Ah, my new charge. I'm told you're in dire need of supplies, and I'm to accompany you into Hogsmeade for them. Is this your first foray into the village? It is. I haven't left the castle since I arrived. Well, I shall endeavor to be the very best of guides, then. Hogsmeade's a charming little place. Self-contained, too. We should be able to find you everything that you need. Shall it's, we? um... <clears throat> I, th that's what I like about this game for Talon, is that they really let everybody be themselves. Um, I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to join you today. As am I. Thank you, by the way. Of course. You're the only one who's ever bested me in a duel. The way I see it, I'd be wise to keep an eye on you. Speaking of Weasley, she seems to have Other taken quite a shine to you. Has she? That's nice to hear. I'm still surprised that a professor would entrust me with anything, given my detention record. I spend a lot of time. It, it was just you. Malfoy in a circle. The rest Trust were kind of nice. Well rounded. Speaking of detention, Revelio to Hogsmeade might have saved me from one. <laughs> Glad I could be of service. Madam Scribner, the librarian, was on the hunt for me, as is often the case. <laughs> Professor Weasley came to retrieve me, and I was able to convince old Scribner that I had somewhere to be. So how did you manage to get on the librarian's bad side? Well, I suspect <laughs> it's a matter of differing opinions. She thinks I shouldn't be allowed in the restricted section, and I, on the other hand, I'm inclined to disagree. Oh, just one moment. This is an excellent spot to gather lace wing flies. They're pretty to look at. If you stew them long enough, they make a powerful potion ingredient. Revelio. I got them all. Let's get out of here. Merlin's beard from the Forbidden Forest. Look. What's going on? See for yourself. Quite a sight, isn't it? <sighs> so you certainly don't see that every day. Do you think Poppy's already seen the hippogriffs? Absolutely. 
Likely already named them too. Yeah, that's true. To the left is the Forbidden Forest. Out of bounds to all students. Oh. Never been in there. The Precisely. They think it's too dangerous. I think they need to have more confidence in our defensive abilities. Sebastian, do you ah, need a rest? You can see hogs me just past those ruins up ahead. It's, they you did such a good job of a little, making this world feel is that? I've been big years, and magical and, Revelio. and beautiful and and oh they did a really like amazing with job I'm not a man go. No. Oh, was that Thestrus? I think it's so cool the way the dragon comes in and then you can see Thestrus. I'm telling you, if they said that this was a precursor to like an MMO, <clears throat> I've always thought I'd play that in a carriage a bit grim, though I suppose most people don't actually see them at all. But you can see them, unfortunately. But you've seen quite a bit yourself firsthand, too. Most notably, that dragon attack. Hopefully, the rest of your year isn't as eventful. Mr. Moon. He's the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Hello, Mr. Moon. Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Uh, you drunk. might want to turn back, Mr. Sallow. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did, Mr. Moon? <gasps> Demi guys. Ugly and airy and terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. A demi, guys. I don't know what he's putting in his pumpkin juice, but he's obviously had too much of it. I've never seen Mr. Moon. Give me state. all that moonstone. Oh, yay. Mr. Moon is quite the character. My sister Anne thinks he's lovely, but I'd say he could improve a bit as a caretaker. Oh, is your sister in Slytherin too? She is, or rather, she was. She's not well at the moment, but she'll be better soon and back at Hogwarts. I hope that's the case, buddy. Oh, yeah. Akio! Give me that pain, motherfucker! Honestly, if one could bottle the magic of this place. I don't know if it's the shops or the people, but there's just something about Hogsmeade. We all flock to it like moths to a flame. Yeah. Find myself scurrying at night these days. Are, are they okay? That's. So how would you like to do this? Weasley told me you had a list of things to get, a wand and some other bits. Yes, Dittany seeds, some spellcraft, and some potion recipes. Perfect. Can't wait to see what you do with a new wand. And a short list gives you plenty of time to poke around the village. I just have to pop into a shop to find something for my sister. Let's meet up in the town circle when you're finished. Consider it Remember, done. Have fun. It's Hogsmeade. See, Sebastian's a really nice guy. All right, so these are the three places I need to go. Ollivanders and tombs and scrolls and J. Pippin's potion. We'll start with the potions, hit the scrolls, end up at Ollivanders, call it a day. Rebellion. Yeah. I've got information. Stuff. 
stuff and such. I love that it is a sign. Yeah, spin that sign, buddy. You got this. <laughs> Rebellion. Uh, yeah. Action. Sorry, I had to be quick. Welcome to J. Pippin's Pushins. Hello, Rebellion. Good. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss La Wang. Not that she <sighs> deigns to come here. Though hey, I you scored a drop. Claim it. Here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. <laughs> How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. A potion's really that versatile. They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake. They are just as powerful. They can heal, I don't have destroy, the protect. You'll Thought discover it. all of this soon enough. And since your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses. And I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? This game does beg of patience. Do it's, it's different uh, for potions. I don't think I would be good at potions. Me. Feel this free guy. to take a look at the rest of my inventory. Or come back another time if you're in a rush today. I'm in a rush. I will come back another time and see your face. Next location. <laughs> Yeah. We go. Whip can't. Two. Two sheep. Ah, how good. How nice of that. That's good. I don't like suits <laughs> from back in that day, though. I don't. Let's go ahead and uh, throw school robe back on. No, you cannot. Um, is everybody okay? All right. Oh, someone's up upstairs. Um, no bingo, no spell making. An inquiring mind. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spell crafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda, <laughs> student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. I think <laughs> you've had a conjuring lesson then. I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. <clears throat> ah, but you will soon enough. That's true, Rattel. It is magic <laughs> is true. at its purest. Creating something out of nothing. Of course, it is not without complexity. I do, really. But that is where my spell press y. come in. Stay y. the course, and you could soon impress are even Professor Are you looking to Beasley. skip, or are you asking That's me to skip? That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I, too, see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spell crafts you need. A potting table and a potion station. Yes? I believe so, sir. Good. 
<laughs> Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Let's have a look. Let's, let's look at what we have, shall we? Let's buy the stuff we need. Micah okay, and... Oh. If you're in Good bye, Mr. Brown. At the rest of my infantry. Oh, I got one more place to visit before I go to all events. Where is it? Damn it. Oh. Well. I want to go to Ollivander's after, so. Let's go. Akio. You're mine. Hello, hello there. Hello. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you, then? Yes. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Reeling all. from how good your beard was. To see it all as one Can big you adventure. teach me? Well, bravo. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. I appear to be Name's now. Timothy Teasdale, by the way. And this is my shop. I keep the cards out here because I'm like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. In addition to <sighs> seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality. Okay. But what's it? Yep, come on. Just give me what I need, bud. Let me guess. You're after something fresh. Do have a look around. Good call, Plenty Bob. of ingredients to pique your interest, <laughs> don't Ollivanders! Here we go! Ollivanders! Yay! Woo! Yay! Woo! Ollivanders! Yay! Sorry. Got out of hand. Got all the... Since 382 BC. Revelio. I'll be right with. Ah, it's you. Um. Just a moment, please. Ah, uh, mm. hello, sir. I'm looking for for a new wand. Yes, it's about time. Oh, no. Yes, uh, about time. Well, oh. you're our new fifth year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivanders, the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest wand makers oh, yeah. in the <laughs> world. It's a pleasure to meet you. Truly. <laughs> Come with me. Let's find you the perfect one, shall we? Let's find you uh, the perfect no, one, no, shall we? Help you. Um, ah, yes. Yes. Powerful core, Powerful ten core. and a half inches. Ten and a half inches? Hmm, you might do. Here, give this one a try. <laughs> well, go ahead, swish. Hmm. How odd. Uh, once more, come on. Really uh, nine thirty EST tomorrow. Oh dear. Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um. We'll find you something, not to worry. Hmm. No, not you. Uh, uh, hmm. Perhaps. Yes. A rare wood, thirteen and three quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. It's cool looking one too. Oh, 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 oh goodness! 
Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. <sighs> this is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. Are you okay? Yes. Okay. I think you might be the one. Here. Take it. All right. <laughs> this is oddly so this is a different one than what they gave me the first time. Um style. So what I got How the first time is actually this one. Uh no, this one. Curious indeed. How intriguing. I do like this spiral. Curious indeed. Curious indeed. I think I'm going to go with this one. 13. We're going to go with that. That's fine. Phoenix will keep. All right, yeah. What do you think? Extraordinary. <laughs> Another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> ah. <clears throat> now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sense a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. Of course. And a phoenix feather core is terribly selective. This will be an excellent match indeed. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. Oh, that's uh, the assistance. I'll destroy you all. <gasps> Bunny Rabbit! Come here, come here, I don't know. Leviosa. Get you. You're going to float. <laughs> Uh, no. Okay. <laughs> that went weird. Quick, huh? Accio. Come to Papa. Did that thing not float? Is that what happened there? All right. <sighs> Levioso. Accio. You don't like me? Right. Hello. Hi. Hello there. Hold uh. bubble. I officially have all of my supplies. Excellent. Did you get what you needed for your sister? <clears throat> I did. So I suppose the world is our oyster now. Let's see what else we can get up to. All right. Hey, 
Are we weakening him at all? Keep at it! We'll wear him down eventually! Taste of his own medicine. Nicely done. Oh, ow. Don't worry about me. I'm just in a lot of pain. That's right, number in loud. He's faltering. You walk in. Do the job. A second troll. Did you two take on a fully grown troll by yourselves? Yeah, because we're awesome, so. lady. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? <coughs> we are, and we were glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that. The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, officer. Singer. Officer Singer. And thank you, again. Well, let's repair around. A moment if you would. I'll go and see what he wants. Sure. One less thing for Officer Singer to worry about. Nice just to be able to repair her stuff. Mr. Hill was just singing your Revelio. Were you singing my praises, Mr. Hill? What were you talking about? Hello, sir. <sighs> I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself, uh, Augustus Hill, Clothier Extraordinaire. Clothier Extraordinaire. Fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring because Oxley to its you married me that way. State. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin, nope. but I can offer you something much more useful. I she am said, glad rags, wizard wear, and looking mum the way she currently looks. Some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. What? Life saving protections. <laughs> and as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of. Always rings. been this weird, darling. Thanks for what you did today. Always. <laughs> you heard me. <laughs> Jeez. That's very kind of you, Mr. Hill. No, oh, what, what, what was I doing? That I didn't pay for. <laughs> Nonsense! <laughs> I insist. Uh, Ginger, now, have a now wonderful let's night. Let's try this on for size, shall we? Plenty <laughs> for your perusal today. Take your time. So glad you did too. Let's put it on. It's actually worse than I've got on it. I'd say we've earned a butterbeer or two, wouldn't you? Might help me forget that I was almost pulverized by a troll. 
I'd say that I agree with you. Perfect. The three broomsticks is just this way. Nice. So what is it? Galleon, sickles, and knuts, right? Let me sell my gear. Plenty for your perusal today. Plenty Take your for your perusal today. Uh oh. Dub a tea. Almost sold that. Much better. Please. Plenty for your perusal today. Bye. Take your time. I crap. Looks like it's zero. Very rude. Sir Hill. Drink your tea. Bye. Sebastian, let's go to the three broom stookles. Assuming it isn't utter bedlam in there. We might even meet Sarah, <clears throat> the owner. She's a good one to know. I do not. Absolutely. Yeah, you can use that one, my love. My message is... Did I miss a message from... Uh, you said you could get to the shop person. when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who is this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. Yeah, that's a really good look. I'd like to see the... Uh thing you're you're using as well you know i may i may pop over and play that with you did they see us i'm kind of feeling i don't it. think so what was that goblin doing with victor rookwood ranrock is working with rookwood the goblin from the daily prophet i knew i'd seen him somewhere quickly let's get inside the three broomsticks get inside get inside <sighs> I'll finish this and then maybe pop over. What do you think? To you you want to play a little I bit? I'll let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, sir. Also, I'm glad you're well. enjoying. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I, I think she is. <laughs> now, what can I... Oh, there's a face I haven't seen before. Is that a man's voice? It's my first time here. Welcome. What, what is a flashpoint? Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one. Single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Cool. Thanks for this. What's My a pleasure. flashpoint? I will say... Trolls in Hogwarts. <clears throat> That's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... <clears throat> What time, Lane? Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? Your clientele's not what it used to be, Sarona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. I said, my friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, the ominous. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butterbeer forever. 
Hello, newbie 47. It has been quite a while. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. I hope you're doing Watch well. Your Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls? Ranrock and Rookwood? What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. I'm not telling you anything. And on that note, I think we should head back to the castle. Also, my best. What is going on? My controller seems to not be working. Dead. Uh oh, yeah, for sure. Yeah, let me know when you're done. I, as a matter of fact, I think I'm going to swap over for a little while. I'm guys. certainly glad. Uh, is everybody was okay there. with that? Told you she was one of the good ones. As soon as I we're able to save that. him, she didn't seem at all intimidated by Rookwood and Arlo. I think you'll need to tell me why Victor Rookwood Happy has to do it, in his But we can talk later. For the moment, we should return to the castle. <laughs> Professor Weasley's certain to hear about so the up. soon if she hasn't already. Star Wars, it is. Don't want to risk another detention for getting back after hours. <laughs> switch okay, okay. I don't that hurts my wife is a very hurtful person sometimes that is my common excuse me Where's my common room? Okay, really? Is that did I? I've tried all of these, right? I'm not crazy. <laughs> Which oh, the Drake, uh, you won the Drake, uh, Vulture. That's right, 1.4 million. I <laughs> thank you. Uh, I just I can't find it. Uh, we're just gonna exit. Close the window. You are correct about that. All right. I don't even need to change my uh, my name very much. My my stream name. Just adding space. Star Wars: The Old Republic. What? Hola? Hola? Here we go. Star Wars. The Old Republic. Welcome. Welcome to the kingdom. Oh.
I'm sorry to hear that, Riddick. Newbie's right, though. Um, at what level are you now, <laughs> Bingus? You're like 50, right? It's like level 50. Should I just grab Subtle here? Subtle is my level 70 sentinel. Oh, that's right. You started over. Yeah, do you think? Yuan Pa has collapsed. All right. Uh, um, that's right. You're liking your your new one better, right? Oh, this is a flashpoint. Or the SLS complete the flashpoint. I'm not so. Yes. It's away. Out of way. It's away. I don't have. Yep. Should have. Jump. This lower Sky Mall. Sky Mall magazine. Sounds weird. But why or how, but it sounds different. That's true. Very, very true. Twenty months arrow two babies. And for obvious reason, the way he's taking that thing to the head. Uh, time to die, bitches. Yeah, his suit looks different, doesn't it, Era? Let's look on Roga. I have, uh... Obviously, taking a break from Star Sital Zon for a while. At least for a little while. Um, maybe until three eighteen goes low. Disappearing. Back. I'm not. There's a hawk rod here. Okay. Hello? Oh. Took that heroin right to the face. 
I don't think I'm going to be able to uh, myself. I just, I can't, um, I can't, I just, I don't know. I'm going to try, but I don't know that I'm going to be able to, like, honestly, I don't know that I'm going to be able to raise that amount of money. Um... <clears throat> Well, while they're focused on you, I will go this way. If that do not not yes. My man can't believe you took on all those gangsters and lived. Well, it's because I'm a badass. Hero, you know that? Yeah. With the network terminals locked down, the speeder traffic is secure. Now, well, all that's left is pushing out those gangsters for good. There was some kind of encrypted message on the network. Looks like a recording. Let me see that. Hmm. It's an old migrant merchant's guild code. I think I can decrypt it. Here we go. You accepted our friendship, Senator Tail. And credits. It's time you paid us back. All we want are the housing oh, projects you promised us people now. Your people will have to wait their turn like everyone else. I owe you nothing. If you continue pushing me, I'll destroy you all. Senator Kale and the Migrant Merchants Guild are at war? That's what this was all about? Your extortion attempt has failed. My <laughs> people are pushing back your little army as we speak. It's over. Nobody breaks a deal with us, Senator. We'll have what we want one way or another. Interesting. This is way above my pay grade. I'm not sure destroying is. the reputation of Coruscant's most popular politician. Take the recording. I don't want it. Be strong, Captain. Exposing corruption is rarely easy, but you have an obligation to this world. I'm risking my life every second I spend down here. The Jedi can sort this out. Senator Kale has done great things for Coruscant. She's a good woman. Give her a chance. Give her a chance. Chancellor Palpatine. Perhaps. Okay. Uh... there actually all right so we did that now i gotta go back that way jeez i want to go do the main storyline or i can pick up a quest here apparently. look what the wampa dragged in i was beginning to wonder what you I just call you me again. did you get the shipment of slave collar chips Take these chips and destroy them, Captain. Oh, I will. Senator Bark will be disappointed, but the law is the law, even for senators. I know he probably offered more, but I can <coughs> at least give you the standard rate for your work. You have my gratitude. You're welcome. You've earned those credits. I've got Damn a lot right of idiot. work to do now. We don't want the senator finding any fault with the way this was handled, but you've got my thanks. Level up! Oh, yeah! So, I uh, got a quest this way that I can go. <clears throat> Honestly, I think I'd have tried to go if it were in Texas, era. I just don't want to go to California too much. Try, but I can't make any promises.
All right. <clears throat> you can go by the way. I'm in uh, chat if you I'm standing by. Standing, get it. Let's do it. Really, scooter or something. Fuck it, rude. Hey, buddy. Oh, buddy. So, what you're saying to me is I should make a new Jedi that's not a Guardian, huh? Is that... Would that be accurate? What, 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 what? I said what you're saying is I shouldn't make, or I should make a, a new Jedi that's not a guardian. Yeah, I would. I tried, I tried it, and I didn't like it. I mean, I'm not. It's a little slow paced. I'd like the, to try. The, it. I went with uh, after trying them all. I went with the Sage, but the Shadow is really fun too. Yeah. You know what? I'll, I'll so, right now, I'm on that, uh, whatever it is, the Esselus or whatever, the ship. Uh-huh. Uh, and it's bugging out, like, a dude's supposed to stop me and tell me to leave the uh, ambassador with the Imperials, and he is not stopping me. Uh-oh. So, I might be logging out and logging back in. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. I'm, and just uh, coming straight right, down there. So... Yeah, I'm gonna do that. You went with Knight. Yeah. And then Sentinel or Sage? Um I am a Sage, but I I did try Shadow at one time and it was really fun too. What was the Sentinel like? Um the story's different. Yeah. Like I didn't get a follower. Well that's like, not you, know, a you, bad get, thing. you get you get T seven with the other one, and then 
you have to do that that stupid stuff where you're looking for like your master sick and all this stuff. You know, I don't yeah. care. That's the you know. consular. Yeah, yeah. Sentinel, oh, the the, two, the double bladed, the two, the dual wielding guy. Yeah. Yeah. I just, I got through like the first, like couple parts. Yeah. And I just didn't like it. I don't know. It's hard to explain. Yeah, that was my first uh, tune. Was the Sentinel? And it's not fun. I just like the double. I like the the dual wielding. And it's cool because there's. Uh... I don't like that I can't dual wield with any other thing. I need. Where is the settings? Turn this shit down. What's fun that I did with the Sentinel is I um, bought two of those Gamorian axes oh, on yeah. the cartel market, and I used those instead of lightsabers for a while. It's pretty nifty, especially when you do the saber throw. Like Boomer Axe? <laughs> yeah, it was actually pretty awesome. <laughs> yeah, that's the good thing about Sentinel. It's got ranged and melee, both. What about uh, the Sage? Can the, Or not the Sage, the Shadow. Can the Shadow dual wield, or is it only double-bladed? It's the double-bladed. Double -bladed. Yeah, but it's cool because you can turn invisible and stuff. Yeah. The Shadow is basically a tank, um, but it's based off of the Sith Juggernaut mm -hmm. on um, the Imperial side. I guess I'm going to go with a Sin. I'm going to give it a try. And maybe I'll be... Shadow's great for... It's got good melee attacks, too. Like, really good melee attacks. Sentinel has pretty powerful ones, too, but it definitely depends on which spec you go into. If you do Watchmen, you're all about DOT. Um, you, you're, there's a... Especially when you have all of your uh, attacks, there's a an order basically to follow to really keep them going on something to really oh, maximize, yeah. especially if you're raiding. Um, otherwise the, um, I forgot what it's called. Um, the, the may, the other melee one is typically what you might use. With this, so yeah, I went and got cartel coins just because it, it's this game's worth 20 bucks to me, you know what I mean? Yeah, Way it's sense. worth it, you know, it's still a deal at 20 bucks. Sure, so I thought, oh, I'll get that. <clears throat> now I won't so, feel guilty for playing for free. <laughs> <laughs> Gave him something. No, there's all kinds of nifty things you can buy, and then customizing your blade color and all that. Armor color. Yeah, I got a set of like, armor and a saber. Yeah, it's like yeah, the, yeah, the, the armor that you saw on my Sentinel, that yellow black, that's all because of the armor paints that you can buy. Oh. Huh. Like the dyes or whatever. Yeah. 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 So basically, you can just get, like, I think for the chest piece, and then you can have them all, like, sync color. If you want it all the same. Ooh. Gosh, now I don't know if I want to play this or hop into Hogwarts. Hop into Hogwarts, man. Give me some Hogwarts. It's a very fun game. So my favorite way to play so far has been the Sith Sorcerer. Yeah. But... None of my friends want to play as Sith, so I'm kind of stuck with the Sage. Yeah, okay, Sorcerer though. is definitely fun. Yeah. It's okay, yeah. though. Especially oh with God. all the AoE attacks he has. Yeah. Oh, yeah, all the lightning stuff. Oh, yeah. Oh, Grimm's... I'd totally be down thing. for playing Imperial. Grimm is... Uh, um salvaging star citizen 
That actually just... I was always super nice to my follower, and then I would just be a total dick and kill everybody else around me. <laughs> yeah, I kind of did a little back and forth with that. There's a particular um, follower that I was just, uh, when I finally got her, I was always, always mean to her specifically. <laughs> Is unavailable. Um, do 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 Long time ago, and I baseball. for it, Graham will vehemently disagree with you. Welcome to Tython, Pat. <clears throat> he wants to uh, remaster this. Your former masters praise your combat skills. They say you're becoming an expert duelist. It's easy to excel when you're trained by the best. I like his voice. The Jedi Council will assign you a new master to oversee your final trials. You'll be tested in ways you can't imagine. But when you leave Tython, you'll know what it means to be a Jedi Knight. More importantly, you'll know yourself. I'm eager to face these trials. Where do I start? There's a speeder here that will take you to... Hang on. I'm getting an emergency signal. Flesh Raiders? Armed with blasters? He must be mistaken. No, mistaken or not, that Padawan is under attack. They've never come this close before. Flesh Raiders are a species of hostile natives. They're smart enough to use tools and violent beyond reason. I'm sending every able-bodied Jedi down to the Padawan training grounds right away. Especially you. Just point the way. I'll handle it. We're outside to the training grounds. Push back the flesh raiders and find out if they're really using advanced weapons. Go. I'll catch up with you after I alert the Jedi Council. May the Force be with you. That's you know. You guys enjoyed Grim. I'm 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 gonna log off from streaming for the night. Um, I will be on tomorrow. I'm just not feeling a hundred percent right now. Um, and I would like to, uh, play this game and, and maybe just chill out. So you guys enjoy Grim. He's salvaging. So he's doing his thing. Um, have fun chit chat with him and yeah, see you guys later. Oh, uh, you know, do some kind for a random stranger. Yeah. Do that. Always do that.